go to Pin Toolbar, then select a font. For this tutorial, I chose Comica Parch font. Right in the text, with black fill color. Click Warped Text Bar on top. In the Warped Text dialog box, select Arc for Style, and apply the following settings. Now resize, and position the text in front of the glass. Take a new layer, then go to the brush tool, adjust the size of the brush, and make a pattern of spilled water effect. Group the top two layers. Double click the space on the right of the layer thumbnail. The layer style dialog is displayed. In the advanced blending option, bring the fill opacity to zero. Now click bevel and emboss, and apply the following settings. Now click the inner shadow. Click on the color bar to select color of shadow. Pick the required shade from the background image by an eyedropper. Click OK. Now apply the following changes. Click the drop shadow. Select the color from color pick or bar. I selected the color from the image, and then adjusted it by putting in the value to get the desired shade. Click OK. Now apply the following changes. Click OK. You can resize the whole effect, if you like. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions regarding my tutorial, ask me in the comments section. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.